cut him off early, I can tell you I'm ready for a bitch like me Still sitting on you bitch, back to back, repeat Nothing but it's all the gas got burned in the sleeves Real trap bitch, I can show you how to flip a pee I ain't gotta tell him getting money, bitch, you can see I ain't got no competition, man, all these bitches weak Gotta pay for the verse, hell no What's up, YouTube? It's Santiago and I'm back with another video I missed y'all, not gonna lie, it's been like three weeks since I posted a video, right? But today, I'm doing a quest, damn <laughs> I'm doing a question and answer video for y'all. And this is my first question and answer video. Because for real, for real, I really just got up here and started posting videos. Y'all don't even, like, y'all don't even know me like that. So, I'm going to introduce myself to y'all. Tell y'all some stuff about me. I asked my Instagram to ask me questions. So, that's the questions that I'm going to use. And, yeah, let's get right into the video. Shoot. Alright, my bad, y'all had to get the questions. I won't even prepare. But first question. I guess I do. Where am I from? I'm from the 757 Norfolk, Virginia, to be exact. Um, how old am I? I'm 23. I just turned 23 in December. And that go to the next question. What sign am I? I'm a Sag. The best sign that ever, ever, ever walked the earth, that ever lived. The best. We the bestest. All my Sagges comment the Sagittarius sign. Um, what's my real name? I, I ain't going to tell y'all my government name, but I will tell y'all that Santiago is not my last name. But Kelly is my real first name. Right, so Kelly Santiago, Kelly is my real name. Um, when did I start rapping? I started rapping like the end of 2020. Yeah, like the end of 2020 is when I like started trying to rap and like yeah in 2020 that's it i think like august no like september 2020 is when i dropped my first video i think don't no i'm lying i'm lying all right i started trying to rap in like august 2020 but i ain't shoot no video until or put out music on all platforms until september 2021 that's when i put out um rocket shirt with wizard y'all go stream that because that's out but yeah that was my first song and i dropped it in september 2021 now august 2020 that's when i first like started trying to rap i was making like voice memos of my phone of me rapping and shit trying to like see how it sound and like i used to try to make everybody listen to my raps <laughs> and they wanted me to shut the fuck up so bad my sister, all her little friends, whatever, whatever. I used to record myself on my phone and then make them listen to it and try to tell me if it was good. But the fact that they ain't want to listen to it for real made me want to keep going. Like, I'm going to make a song that they want to listen to type shit. And, like, I was, like, impressing myself. Like, each song would be better and better. So it made me, like, want to keep going with it. But, yeah, August 2020, like, end of 2020, that's when I started trying to rap. And then the following year... September 2021 is when I finally put out music. And I guess that go with what would I do if I didn't rap? And y'all, I don't know. Well, I, I kind of got an idea because like before I rapped, I used to be like real like academic. I, I don't know what the word is. Uh... I don't know, but I used to be into school real bad. Whatever the word, whatever that word is, that's it right there. <laughs> I used to be into school real bad. I used to get unroll every um, report card. I used to talk at the assemblies, all that like top tier student. <laughs> but, um, and I was supposed to go to college to NSU. I actually got accepted to NSU to, uh, for pre-nursing. And I got accepted into a few other colleges too. A college for business, a college for fashion design. So I don't, I really don't know. But 
other than like college and stuff like that i think maybe real estate because like i always talked about real estate i always like real estate i always like real estate shows i used to watch um what's that show um from bravo where they used to sell houses not shows of sunset and they had one in new york and LA. y'all know what i'm talking about you know what i'm talking about just comment what the show called but yeah i used to watch some shows they just got one like that on netflix but that's not the main one. Oh, million dollar listings that's what it is i used to watch that and just love it so probably if i didn't do rap i would do real estate but even with doing rap i probably still end up doing real estate anyway because like i got to have a balance like i got to have like the fun and like the the learning you get what i'm trying to say like i need i need both Mm. people i want to collab with youtube and rap all right so for people i want to collab with with youtube mm, i would like to collab with jay cinco that's like my favorite youtuber right now featuring geo i think she is like so raw oh my god she's so raw um who else i collab with any of your rns because i be i be in texas now they can hit me up trey or um deuce whoever got um who up i collab with on youtube anybody for referee if any girls in my city or anybody want to collab just hit me up we, we can do it and uh for rob anybody want to collab with for rob uh I guess like why saying capo if you're from 757 you know who i'm talking about or uh little tony or let me think of a girl enchanting i feel like me and enchanted will make a banger or even uh Cola Ray. I collab with Cola Ray on YouTube or rap. Whatever you wanna do. We could just kick it. We don't even gotta we don't even gotta do no content for him. Cause we be we be on the same little little vibe. Um Am I single? Yes. Absolutely. And you could get in my DM and you could get you could jump in my DM all day, every day. <laughs> I'ma try to add the clip. Oh. Fuck no. And I'ma leave and I'ma stand on that. Okay. And they can get in my DM. You can get in my DM all you want every day. What I'm talking about. Cause if you know, you know. You can get in my DM. You can get it get in my DM all day, every day. Yes, single, hundred percent. I'm not even looking for no relationship right now. I'm just trying to focus on this. Focus on y'all. Focus on me. No, you know what I'm saying? What's my favorite song right now? Slash, what's my favorite artist? All right, so boom. Right now, my favorite song. Okay, I got two favorite songs. My first favorite song is Nicki Minaj, Falling For You. That's the best song off the album. I don't care. Argue with me. The Bob, y'all can get in the comments. Falling For You is the best song on the album. Period. I step that. Mm, the vocals, the, the verses. She did what she had to do. Period. And then the next favorite song is A Boogie Did Me Wrong. Because if you know, you know. A Boogie just that nigga. Like, you can play that song a hundred times. And every time, it's still going to hit. Like, it's still going to hit. So, that's another one of my favorite songs. And as far as my favorite artists, all right, so look. I love Nicki Minaj for the girl artists, right? For the boy artists, it get kind of complicated. Matter of fact, for the boy artists, I'm going to just do a top five. All right, so my top five artists, this boys or whatever. A Boogie. Can't do no wrong in my ass. He an artist. Like he said, like his name is. His mama knew what she was doing. NBA Young Boy, Lil Baby, No Cap. Mm. Who 
I'm going to give the last a spot to A Boogie, Young Boy, Baby, No Cap. Um, maybe Love Papa, but I don't know. Let me, I need to double, triple check. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to go, I'm going to go Lil Papa. I'll go Lil Papa. Because I listen to, like, his album all the way through. If I can't listen to your album all the way through, you, you're not even on the, you're not even on the chart for me, baby. But, yeah, I'll go with that. A Boogie, Young Boy, Baby, No Cap, Lil Papa. Do I have any celebrity crushes? No. But I do think, like, it's a lot of celebrities that's, like, cute or, like, you know, that's, like, popping it. But somebody that I'm looking at right now is Lil Nar. I don't know if y'all know him or not, but I think he is the coolest thing. Like, he raw. He raw. Yeah, he raw. Um, Do I have any tattoos or piercings? Nope. <laughs> the only piercings I have is my ears and I don't have earrings on right now. So no tattoos, no piercings. But I'm thinking of getting a tattoo the next time I'm in Houston or Texas. I don't know if I'm going to get it in what part of Texas I'm going to be in when I get it. But I think I'm going to get a tattoo, my first tattoo when I go back to uh, Texas. So... Stay tuned for that. I'm definitely going to vlog if I get one, which I really, really think that I am. Like, it's time to mark, like, this new chapter. And they're going to be like, who, Kelly with the tattoo? And then they're going to be like, nah, the Kelly I know don't get no tattoos. Exactly, bitch. You don't know me. That's what I'm saying. Nah, I mean, you used to know me. But you don't even know me no more. This new Kelly got tattoos and all that. But not for real. I really think about getting a tattoo when I go back to Texas, so... Yeah, that would be my first tattoo, and y'all might get it with me. Um, where do I see myself in a couple years? Okay, I ain't gonna give y'all like too much scoop on like my goals and shit, but I just hope that I got. Well, I plan, and I gonna say I hope plan have all my businesses running, my rap career flourishing, my YouTube flourishing, living in another city, doing what I want to do, like wake up, do what I want to do. And I made all my money from my craft, my passions, my arts that I put out to the world. That's it. Um, my favorite brand or designer. So right now, I think my favorite brand or designer would be like Bape and Off White, cause like right now I'm into like the streetwear vibe, like like put that shit on, and I feel like they got like good pieces for like tennis shoes, like you know what I'm saying, like like throw on clothes and be flat for the day, like yeah, I get what I'm trying to say, like it ain't it's it's that shit, period. So, Bape and Off-White will be, like, my favorite right now. Um, top five movies. Okay. Y'all. Let's see. We got ATL. You got to go ATL off the gate. Friday at the Nets. Oh, wait. No, that's next Friday. The one with Day Day. Next Friday. I think that's next Friday. Um, All About the Benjamins. Sixty fucking million dollars. Lot of ticket. Are you talking about crazy? Nigga. I'm insane. I'm kind of crazy. I'm crazy. Sixty million dollars for my motherfucking lotto ticket. And I'm crazy. Nigga. I'm insane. Nigga. <laughs> But nah, uh, okay. ATL, all about the Benjamins. Next Friday, Clueless, gotta go Clueless. Uh, mean Girls, top five. Honorable mention, 
white chicks and yeah we just go white chicks and i think this is the last question y'all what's my comfort show and right now my comfort show is friends but I sh they should have asked me what's my favorite show and my favorite favorite fa all right i'm gonna give y'all top five shows this is i'm adding in my own shit top five shows that i ever watch feel free to go watch them because each one is a banger all right boom pretty little liars if you know you know i i know i ain't putting too many people on that because it, it was a time but if you know you know if you don't know go watch it crazy gossip girl Period. The whole, the whole. If you, if you feel like an it girl, if you feel like you that girl, go watch Gossip Girl. That's for you. Prison Break. Them niggas was smart as a bitch. Oh my god! If you never seen Prison Break, go watch Prison Break. Uh, what else? A good ass show. Uh, what's the show called? With a blind lady on Netflix. I forget what it's called. It's it's like the blind spot, the blind way. I don't fucking know. It's about this blind lady on Netflix. She started selling drugs and everything. Little was off the chain. Good as hell. And a fifth show that I don't bench watch the whole thing. Um... I know some good shows. I don't know why I can't think of it right now. Shit. Watch. I don't know. Right now, right now, my favorite show right now is Outer Banks. And I'm waiting on the next season. So, if you ain't watched that, go watch that. And then when the new season come out, we can talk about it, you know? But yeah, that was my question and answer video for y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thank you if you watched to the end. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks for fucking with me. And um, yeah, I'm gonna do another question and answer when I get more subscribers. Probably like when I get the 500 subscribers and update y'all. Get me to 100 subscribers because I'm doing a giveaway. I'm going to buy somebody Chick-fil-A once I hit 100. So, subscribe to the channel. Like the video again. If you ain't like it when I told you to like it the last time. Uh, new music on the way. Keep streaming Street Smith Santiago. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of new content on the way, y'all. I promise, I promise. And, yeah.